my hair. Come in. Thank you. I'll be with you in a minute. I, I don't know if it would pass safety regulation. Everybody going out with me. Great, we're here. I'd like to... Uh, you probably know more people here than me. What do you do? Come on, I ask first. I work with Mallory. I'm really interested in seeing... Come on, get out of there, tough guy! Hey, it's Nico. Hey, I'm just finishing my hair. Come in. Thank you. I'll be with you in a minute. Did you just move in? No. Why? All your stuff is new. Some even still have tags on. Yeah, well, I like things clean. I can see that. But uh, everything is new. Yeah, I'm kind of obsessed with cleanliness. Things get on my nerves and I just throw them out. OCD or something? Oh. So, where are you taking me? Uh... You look good. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'm new here. I thought maybe we could go to the, uh... Fun fair. Yeah, great! Let's go! Love the fun fair! Actually, we call it, um, carnival here. Just a little difference. Uh, whoop de doo <laughs> yep. So, Michelle, what do you like to do? What do you like to do? Come on, I asked you first. I like to keep active, I guess. Sports, working out. Things like that. I'd like to know about you, though. See the places you hang out. Yeah, maybe another time. Do you think that this is safe?
the carnival isn't open this time of year. I, I don't know if it would pass safety regulations anyway. There's a bowling alley over on the boardwalk. Why don't we play a few frames? Cool. Let's go bowling, Dan. Thanks for taking me out. I haven't been on a date for a while. I'm kind of lonely here. I thought you were doing me a favor by going out with me. Great, we're here. I'd like to play a few frames, wouldn't you? I'm not a local in Liberty City. I came here from uh, somewhere... Where? Oh, uh, the Good. Midwest. <laughs> you probably know more people here than me. More assholes, maybe. Shame we couldn't finish that game, Nico. It was fun playing, though. Can you take me back now? Of course I'll take you home. Let's go. So, you don't know many people here at Liberty City? No boyfriends or husbands or anything? No, I guess I'm married to my job. Well, what do you do? What do you do? Come on, I asked first. I work with Mallory. What do you do, exactly? You're a hard girl to talk to, Michelle. I guess you're not used to talking to American women. I guess. So what are you doing here in Liberty City, Nico? What's anybody doing here? I don't know. I think you do. There must be something that made you leave your home and come here. Roman's bullshit stories, maybe. I just felt like I needed a new start. There's nothing else about Liberty City then? Just Roman? Maybe there is more to this place. I'm not sure yet. That was nice. I'm really interested in seeing you again. Yeah, that would be good. I'll give you a call. Please do, Nico. See you soon. from them in the first place, Roman. Anyway, I was seeing Michelle. I thought you wanted me to date her. Not when it means me getting beat up and sent to hospital. Come and pick me up, cousin, and at least tell me that you got some titties out. Maybe then your betrayal will be worthwhile. What a nice titties, yes? You're an animal, Roman. Nothing can stop you being horny. I'll see you soon. who chose Cooch before his cousin. I hope she was worthy. Will you drive me back to the office, cousin? Oh. How was she, cousin? Tell me how she was. I wondered about Michelle when I first met her. If she was not a friend of Mallory's, it would be me with the smell of titty on my breath and you who ended up in hospital. Firstly, Roman, my breath does not smell of titty. Secondly, I don't think that your loan shark friends could hospitalize me. I can look after myself. All the more reason why I should have hooked up with Michelle. Everyone would be a winner. Yes, well, 
I will not let these men treat you like that again. I'm sorry for letting you down, Ron. Roman.